10. Colossal Woolly Mammoth Colossal Biosciences, a biotech startup, aims to bring back woolly mammoths through DNA and expert knowledge. Most scientists believe that these large mammals coexisted with early humans who hunted them for sustenance, leading to their extinction. The mammoths once roamed the cold tundra until 1650 BC, grazing on grass and shrubs. However, with the melting of ice caps, their primary food source was obliterated, causing their demise. To achieve their objective, Colossal Biosciences plans to merge mammoth DNA extracted from under Siberian ice with that of an Asian elephant, resulting in a hybrid creature known as a mammophant. The proposed project presents opportunities such as increasing the number of elephants and restoring landscapes to reduce climate change. However, ecological researchers have opposed the idea, citing that the mammophants cannot replicate the exact behavior of the original woolly mammoth. Moreover, the endeavor's logistics are deemed unrealistic. Therefore, it remains uncertain which argument will emerge victorious as we wait in anticipation for the project's completion in 2027. 9. The MOA After the Polynesian people settled in New Zealand, the majestic MOA bird went extinct. This particular bird, which was incapable of flight, ranged in size from that of a chicken to towering heights of up to 3 meters. There were 9 types of MOA and their total population was estimated to be around 2.5 million. The South Island giant MOA, in particular, was the tallest bird to ever exist. The females of this species could weigh over 500 pounds, 227 kilograms. The MOA's inability to fly made it a vulnerable target for human hunters who sought to consume their meat. Unfortunately, the MOA's reproductive rate was slow, with only one or two eggs being laid at a time. It didn't take long for the population to be wiped out within a mere 150 years. Recent developments by scientists at Harvard University are impressive. In 2018, they were able to construct a genome that was almost complete for one of the MOA species, known as the Little Bush MOA. This achievement brings them closer to realizing the prospect of using the genome to create an animal that resembles the extinct species. It is the hope of these scientists to resurrect the MOA species and, in addition, the dodo bird, which was recently discovered to have its genome reconstructed by Australian scientists. Though we have yet to see any newly created MOA species in existence today, experts believe that it will not be long before a successful MOA de-extinction occurs. Eight. Saber-toothed tiger Saber-toothed felines, the extinct carnivorous mammals that once roamed the earth, were colossal in size, equivalent to the weight of a male polar bear and stretching up to 10 feet in length. With no natural predators, they preyed on massive creatures such as bison, mammoths, and mastodons. Although they are distantly related to modern-day felines, they succumb to extinction due to excessive hunting and changes in the climate. Recent research has uncovered their DNA, which revealed that they employed the technique of endurance hunting and possessed excellent vision during the day. Despite their disappearance 10,000 years ago, there has been a growing interest in resurrecting these beasts. However, the scarcity of retrieved DNA poses a significant obstacle in such endeavors. Nonetheless, experts are optimistic that through extensive research, they can surmount this hurdle and revive one of the most terrifying apex predators to have ever existed. 7. Lena Horse In the month of August during the year 2018, a consortium of researchers had embarked upon a mission to unearth mammoth tusks within the vicinity of the Verkhoinsk region of Siberia when they chanced upon the conspicuously well-preserved remnants of a lena foal in the permafrost of the Batagaika crater. Upon subjecting the specimen to thorough analyses, scientists were able to extract samples of blood and urine from the foal, which, in accordance with scientific conjecture, had presumably been a mere fortnight old when it had met its unfortunate demise over 40,000 years ago as a result of being ensnared in viscous mud. Subsequently, in 2019, scientific authorities announced their confident expectation to revive the Lena horse species through the employment of the blood samples extracted from the foal's heart. Furthermore, they affirmed the Lena foal to be incontrovertibly the most well-conserved artifact from the Ice Age to have been discovered. 
At the time of the pronouncement, scholars continued to deliberate upon possible strategies for propagating viable cells from the extracted blood samples, along with alternative measures that could be adopted to resurrect the lena horse via the internal organs of the foal. 6. The Dodo In the year 1662, the dodo bird became extinct. This means that current-day scientists must rely on historical paintings to accurately depict the bird's appearance. Not a single taxidermy dodo exists today, as the last remaining specimen was destroyed in a fire at a museum back in 1755. There was a time when many individuals doubted that the dodo had ever existed at all. However, this skepticism was put to rest when several sets of dodo bones were uncovered. Back in 1832, researchers discovered a swamp in Mauritius that contained so many dodo bones that they could easily pluck them from the water. Fast forward to 2005, and a team of researchers claimed that they had unearthed a vast assortment of bird bones, including roughly 20 complete dodo skeletons, on a sugarcane plantation in Mauritius. Human beings played a significant role in the dodo's extinction. Overhunting and deforestation led to the bird's demise. Furthermore, these creatures lacked an inherent fear of humans, so when people approached their nests, they felt no apprehension. As a result, their nests were frequently destroyed. Colossal Biosciences has put forth an ambitious plan to revive the dodo. They intend to accomplish this by editing the genetic material of the dodo's surviving relatives. However, many experts are skeptical of this undertaking and doubt that it can ever come to fruition. Nevertheless, Colossal Biosciences remains steadfast in its belief that the dodo can and will be resurrected, provided the necessary genetic processes can be fully developed. 5. Cave Lion Some scholars contend that the prehistoric cavernous feline possessed more characteristics akin to contemporary tigers as opposed to present-day lions. However, the majority of academics maintain that the cave lion bore resemblance to the lions we are familiar with today and is a precursor to the species. The cave lion was a substantial creature, towering nearly 4 feet meters, above the ground and extending to a length of 7 feet meters. Their dietary preferences consisted of reindeer and young bears, and their territory spanned across a vast expanse of land, encompassing Canada, Alaska, Eurasia, and China. In 2018, the frozen remains of two cave lion cubs were discovered in the Siberian permafrost. Initially presumed to be siblings, Sparta and Boris, research unveiled that the two cubs were separated by 15,000 years. These majestic creatures were remarkably well preserved by the icy terrain, with their pelts and whiskers still intact. The geneticist from South Korea, Won Woo-suk, swiftly set to work on a scheme to revive the extinct cave lion by extracting tissue from the cubs. Thus far, he has been unsuccessful, and only time will reveal whether or not we will ever witness the awe-inspiring sight of the cave lion traversing the earth once again. 4. Orak Bull During the epic of Holocene, the Orok, a breed of untamed ox, roamed and dwelt within the borders of Poland. As temperatures globally soared, the Orochs migrated. These gigantic creatures reached heights of up to 1.8 meters and exhibited a grandiose display of horns that extended beyond 1.3 meters. They imposed an immense influence upon their human counterparts, who, in admiration, captured their likenesses within cave walls and sent them to engage in battle against Roman gladiators. The Aurochs existed in various regions, including Asia, India, and North Africa. However, due to habitat loss and excessive hunting, the Aurochs species became extinct in 1627. Scientists have been diligently laboring on the project to revive the Auroch breed since 2012, utilizing genetic tissue extracted from contemporary cattle breeds. Although they have yet to achieve their lofty goal, the latest reports reveal that they are gradually drawing closer by meticulously refining the back breeding process. If the project proves successful, the Aurochs may once again inhabit dense forest territories and simultaneously restore lost ecosystems to their previous states. 3. Steppe Bison Steppe Bison roamed vast territories across North America, Asia, Europe, 
Canada, and Mexico, which are collectively known as the Pleistocene Bison Belt. These awe-inspiring creatures were massive and survived for half of the Holocene epoch before meeting the same fate as many other ancient animals, mainly as a result of human hunting and climate shifts. The Porcupine River in 2006 yielded the oldest fossil of a steppe bison discovered in the United States, while the permafrost in the Yukon has yielded dozens of fossils, one of which is affectionately known as Blue Babe due to the Vivianite Coast bluish tint of its skin. Blue Babe's remains were in exceptional condition, being 36,000 years old, and her cause of death was immediately evident, she had suffered severe wounds from a bearing in lion attack. In 2016, a team of scientists declared that they would clone a Canadian wood bison and subsequently resurrect the steppe bison using the remnants of a steppe bison tail discovered in the Siberian permafrost. The procedure has yet to yield any outcomes, but that does not imply that researchers will not make a breakthrough soon. 2. T. Rex The endeavor to revive dinosaurs, specifically the Tyrannosaurus rex, is an ongoing and stimulating research project that captivates paleontologists and scientists worldwide. Although the consensus is that the ancient fossils of dinosaurs are too old to provide any useful tissue, the Adam Smith Institute refuses to let this fact deter them from attempting to backbreed flightless birds through DNA isolation technology. As birds are considered the modern-day equivalent of dinosaurs, and by isolating their DNA and utilizing gene technology, it is plausible that the T-Rex, portrayed in the movie Jurassic Park, could be present by 2050. The institution is also preparing to expand its project beyond just resurrecting the T-Rex, with the intention of using the same technology to revive other species of dinosaurs. 1. The Legendary Dire Wolf the legendary dire wolf was not just a mythical creature, but an actual animal that perished with the extinction of other large animals like the mammoths and saber-toothed tigers at the conclusion of the last ice age. These beasts differed significantly from the wolves of today to the point where scholars propose assigning them their own taxonomic classification. Dire wolves were remarkable predators, taking down mammoths, horses, and bison, and some met their demise after becoming trapped in the La Brea tar pits while in hot pursuit of their prey. Even before their appearance in Game of Thrones, Lois Schwartz embarked on a project in 1987 to bring back the species through breeding. Her goal was to create an animal that resembled a dire wolf in appearance but had the demeanor of a dog. She began her work with German Shepherds and worked her way through various dog breeds such as Alaskan Malamutes before eventually producing the American Alsatian. Despite the resemblance, the American Alsatian is not a dire wolf and never will be. However, while scientists have successfully sequenced the DNA of dire wolves, modern wolves share no genetic links with them, so it is currently impossible to use back breeding techniques to revive the species. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel for more content. Also, don't forget to share this video with your friends. We appreciate your support. Bye.